Hi guys and kaboom! Yes, welcome to the channel and to my mate Simple Attack Strategy Series for Town Hall 13. And who's on the army cup today? We've got Yetis and yes, over here, Super Wizards. We've got an amazing and easy to use attack strategy. We're going to check out some replays in just a moment. Before we do, let's meet the troops. So guys, your army is going to be 10 Super Wizards, 2 Baby Dragons and 10 Yetis. Spells are going to be 1 Rage, 1 Freeze and 8 Earthquake Spells. Your donated clan castle spells will be a further free spell and poison spell to sprinkle on top clan castle troops. Two yetis of Valk and Bob the Barbarian. And guys, if I can get this attack strategy to work, so can you. I'm 403 years old and I've got the reaction speed of a newt. So anyway, we're going to jump into a replay in just a moment. Before we do, just a quick reminder on this channel, we've got something called a creator code. That's where you can help support your favorite content creator in-game by using their code before making any purchases. I put a link that does all of that for you in the video description, or you can just go into the shop in-game and click on that C emblem in the top right-hand corner, and then if you enter code MOO, I'm joking, it's code MOOSE, guys, yes. Not code MOUSE, code MOOSE. If you enter code MOOSE, uh, at least once a week, you have to renew it once a week, before making any purchases in-game, it helps support the channel. Thank you very much. Anyway, on to the replays, guys. Yes, on to the replays. So here we go. We've got uh, triple Inferno Towers on the left, quad Expos on the right. What are we going to do? I'll tell you what we're going to do, guys. We're going to funnel. So it's funnel time. Use your baby dragons normally to help funnel the base. And what I like to do, guys, you don't always have to open up walls with the earthquake spells. You can use, use them to damage structures. Each earthquake spell takes nearly a third of the health off any building. So you can do real damage to that base. Now we're just going to send in the log launcher here. It will open up the walls. And there we go. And now we can use that Grand Warden ability nice and early. So with your funnel... Normally, it's going to be Baby Dragon left, Baby Dragon on the right, and the rest of the troops in the center. If that isn't enough, you might need to put a Yeti on the left-hand side, Yeti on the right, and then send in your Super Wizards behind the main army. So, guys, what I would say is use your Grand Warden ability nice and early. Protect as many troops as possible. Try and save a Rage spell for the Town Hall if you need it, and then just watch your troops. Use the Poison spell on the enemy Clan Castle troops, of course. Watch your royal champion. She's very important. Make sure you look after her and she doesn't run into any sort of single target infernos or enemy heroes. Uh, you've got a free spell or two there that you can use to help her out as well. So this is looking pretty good. We've got the queen over on the right hand side. A couple of yetis. I can see Boris the yeti. How are you doing, Boris? And uh, guys, uh, do remember, I've got a, a, I've actually got a yeti in the room with me right now. And the yeti says, uh, do remember to hit the subscribe button and notification bell and join the Samus army. Uh, yes, guys, uh, we've got nearly 108,000 subscribers. Can you imagine 108,000 yetis? That is very scary. Anyway, back to the replay. The queen's still there. We've got some super wizards helping out. We've got three yetis. What do you call a group of yetis? A swarm of yetis. I like that. I don't think it's right. I don't actually know if there is a Yeti's real. Maybe. I'm sure I've saw I sure I saw a Yeti in town the other day. I was just walking to town to buy a, a croissant and I saw I think it was a Yeti in the field next to me. I uh, looked over to my wife and said, There's a Yeti there and she said, No, it was the cow. And I said, What? Well, they look quite similar from a distance, I guess. Anyway, on to the next replay. Centralized town hall. What are we gonna do here? We're going to get three stars. That's what we're going to do, guys. So, four earthquake spells there, just opening up the base, because I did want to open up those walls this time. Then, it's funnel time, guys. So, where are we going to funnel? We're going to funnel on the left-hand side, I believe. Uh, four more earthquake spells there. Of course, at Town Hall 13, you don't need to worry about Builder Hut's repairing stuff, which is great. Baby Dragon on the left. And one thing I would say, guys, never zoom in on a Baby Dragon and look at... They're, they're not very nice close up. Uh, so yeah, just a bit of warning there. You're going to do it now, aren't you? But anyway, on this base, I would say normally use the log launcher, guys. But on this base, I'm really confident that the troops are going to go to the town hall. If you're very confident, then use the siege barracks. You get loads of value out of the siege barracks. We're sending the royal champion on the left-hand side. We've got those three spells to help her out if we need to. She looks like she can take care of the left-hand side of the base, though. Are we going to take out the town hall? Yes, that was an awful... Guys, that was the worst placed freeze spell ever i missed the town hall uh, the second one got the town hall but the first one missed uh, we all make mistakes guys my spell placement is awful um very bad indeed anyway uh, is the royal champion going to be okay against that single target inferno yes she is and now she says hello scattershot how are you doing goodbye scattershot thank you very much nice to meet you 
uh, do have a nice day. And on to the... <laughs> Sorry, guys. On to the rest of the room. What's going on? The Queen. Queen ability has been used. We've still got the King ability. Now, are we going to get into a bit of, bit of difficult here? Uh, I'm not sure, guys. But the Royal Champion looks like she is running out of health. She's gone. She's gone, guys. She is sleeping now. And the Queen is about to get taken. And Queen is gone as well. We're losing. Just Gary the Grand Warden is left on the left. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. The King with his ability there. Uh, the, level 73 King. Uh, my King is called Dave the Barbarian King. He's not max level yet. Uh, he said, Samus, when are you going to level me up? And I said, listen. When I get enough Dark Elixir, I'm sorry. I've, uh, you know, I'm busy at the moment. I'm trying. And he said, listen, get your priorities right, Mr. Moose. Get me some Dark Elixir. I want to get to level 75. Okay, Dave, we'll do that as soon as I can. Anyway, uh, before we go, guys, uh, just a quick reminder on this channel, on YouTube, we've got something called Channel Memberships. That's the way you can officially help support the channel on YouTube. I've got a link uh, that gives you more information about that in the video description. You get certain perks, such as an amazing base design, Town Hall 14 wants a month. But if you're Town Hall 13, uh, yeah, that might not be any good to you. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video today, guys. Remember to hit that subscribe button. I will see you later. Thanks for watching.